Uh, oh, I got in the car. This one because I had a call. Of course, we're, we're working. Today. People having six-figure jobs and not necessarily don't have to have a college degree, but people be like work productive, still have a life being outside. YouTube is me, your boy, Jeronica King. I'm back with another video. And as you can see from the title, I'm just trying to give you guys an update. I had to put this on because I had a call. Of course, we're, we're working today. Welcome. I know I haven't posted a video in a while. It has been crazy busy these last couple months with work. Um, just found out yesterday my manager is leaving, which I am super duper sad about because he's like the best manager. He's the manager that hired me at this company and... I'm like happy for him, but sad at the same time that he's leaving because like, I don't know, I just don't like starting over with like new managers, learn, like learning me, learning my style. And like I said, he was not a micromanager. Like, you know, as long as you get your work done, he didn't bother me. So I'm hoping I get the same type of manager that I'm getting assigned to next. Um, Yeah, so I have a... It's 10.54 a.m. I have a meeting with him at 11 a.m. to like talk and I guess go over my book of business, um, discuss like what accounts I kind of like um, need extra attention or focus on with. Um, like I said, I have I had three accounts that were escalated. Now I'm down to two accounts. They're not really escalated, but a lot of their ask is like some things we cannot do. Um, so that's where I met with them. But uh, yeah, I just want to make y'all just say, hey, this, I guess I'll do another day in the life of customer assist manager or life update what's been going on since I last film. My daddy's about to die. I'm about to hop on this call. So let me charge this and I'll be back. All right. So we are off. The calls you have changed because I don't have uh, So the calls that I'm on for the rest of the day, I don't have to show my face. So that's why I don't. It's not just that one call that I have. That my camera has to be on so now that we're done it is lunchtime. i had a what is going on usually the light my camera adjusts adjusts to background anyway so the rest of the day i don't have any calls i have to show my camera um my next meeting got canceled so it is lunchtime. so i'm about to eat lunch i made me put y'all down Or do I want? Yeah, I need my salad. <laughs> yeah, I've been like eating salad since we've done lunch. Um, but yeah, so hope you guys have been well. I'm not. I'm trying to get back. I feel bad because I need to start at posting videos at least once a week. Um, I know a lot of you probably found me on TikTok because I was on this one video. Um, I don't know if I can insert that video because I don't want to get a copyright strike, but I was in, I commented on one video of someone that I follow on TikTok um, and I'll insert her stuff too. And basically about people having six figure jobs and not necessarily don't have to have a college degree, but people need six figure jobs because if you're trying to buy a house right now in this type of economy, you gonna need a higher paying salary. So I just commented and I was like, hey, I'm a customer success manager. This is what my OTE is for the year. If you know what OTE is, my on target earnings. So basically I have a base salary and on top of my salary, I have my my OTE, basically what I'll make with my commission. Um, and actually I feel like my OTE is gonna be higher than what I was hired for to get because last quarter I exceeded my quarterly goal by 118 percent so basically anytime of course you receive your goals you get paid out more so last quarter i got paid out two thousand dollars i want to say it was like two thousand dollars more than what i was already going to get paid out and i ain't gonna tell my business but after taxes just know i had a it was a one a number a comma zero 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 that hit my and that was net okay so that's why we're telling people 
you know, these CS jobs is where it's, where it's, where it wants to be. Somebody asked me, is this like my long term career goal? I do like being a customer success manager, um, but if you ask me what my ultimate goal like five years from now is, I definitely want a government job. I want to work for the federal government, um, but I just had to figure out what I want to do in the federal government, which leads me to also why I may be going back to school um, to finish. Um, so. I started my degree in health information technology. Basically what that is, is I can, in that realm, my goal was I wanted to be a medical coder, but that was something I always wanted to do on the side, because as a medical coder, being a medical coder, that's a job view that you can do on the side. Um, and what prompted that was I met another customer success manager and was talking, because she's a customer success manager for a healthcare company, a healthcare um, SaaS company. And she was telling me that she does, she's customer success and she does medical building and medical coding on the side with contractors. And I was like, I, I started school, but I never finished. So I've been working with the school, one of the colleges here. As a community college, all you need is a two year degree. One of the community colleges here because um, in trying to see what courses I would be able to transfer. And being that it's been a while since I took those classes and a lot has changed in the healthcare world. So we're going through that, we'll see. So keep it updated, but I'm about to be my Saturday and I'll be back. All right, so this is my my little salad here I got. Um, what else has been going on? Oh, I got a new car. So if y'all, I don't know if y'all knew this, if you're new here, but my last car, ooh, my last car I had was a um, Volkswagen Passat. So um, my lease was up, so I leased that car. So here's the thing, I am a leaser. I like to lease cars because one, I like to have a brand new car every three to four years. Um, that's just my thing. I don't, I understand people are against leases. If you are, that's you. Like I was telling somebody who tried me, um, like I said, you like to have kids every three to four years. I like new cars every three to four years. Like, you paying daycare, I'm paying car pay. Uh, but anyway, this is my new baby. It is a Volkswagen Tiguan. Um, it is the R line. So, I love, I'm a Volkswagen guy. I know a lot, a lot people are shocked. They're like, I don't drive like a BMW or Mercedes or Lexus. Like, and I try to find, I already, I've had those cars. I mean, to be 33, I've had a Mercedes. I've had a BMW. I've had a Lexus. I mean, I already, I mean, I don't know. I've, I've had that before, but I just love Volkswagen. Um, but this is my new baby. It's a Arlon Tiguan. Um, give y'all a little tour. I love this car. Um, so I had the car. They no longer make, make the Passats. So when I returned it, he was like, what do you want next? So I was like, you know what, I want the, let me take a look at the Tiguan. So I got this. I love the little, it's my first car I had with the little whatever you want to call it. Um, got the brown seats. I got the, the sunroof. I mean, it's me. I like it. And I like how this illuminates. I, I didn't know this until the night when I got, when I got home. I was like, oh, that looks good too. But it's spacious. I mean, it's just me. It does have, if you can see, it does have a third row. And I like it. And I love, oh my gosh. I love the Volkswagen car smells, like the leather, the leather car smells of a Volkswagen. Like I said, this car was brand new. Um, when I bought it, it had five miles on it. So, yes, I'm the first owner. Um, so, another lease. I probably, so this lease is three years. Um, I think after this lease, I've been starting to like the Mercedes, like the G, I think it's the GLC AMG Coupe. I'm starting to ask, cause I saw a white one with like a white, I love white cars. My last car was black, I'm never getting a black car. I saw a white one with black rims. I was like, oh my gosh, but when I look at the price tag and then the maintenance, oh my gosh. The maintenance on that is another thing where I was just like, um, I don't know. 
if that's something I'm pressed to have. But anywho, I'm about to eat lunch really fast. I know I've just been rambling, but I feel like I just want to give y'all a life update about what's been going on. Um, I need to check this stuff for school. And yeah, and then the, another thing about it, I will say about my job is like, I make, like, I make, like, how can I say this about being like, so my salary, like, even if I go back to school and I was looking at it because, like, I'm in North Carolina and I'm going to a community college and I was looking at the semesters where I was like, oh, I can afford to pay this out of pocket, you know, just because just I won't have any debt because I am working on, I'm late to the game because I'm just not learning, but I'm trying to start investing in, like, Roth. Roth 401k. I don't know, this is girl I follow on TikTok, this girl and this guy. And I follow them both because they both be saying the same things that make sense to me. And I feel like, oh, okay, so I want to start investing into a Roth, a Roth RA, a Roth RA, I believe is what it's called. Um, because I was looking at some of like the stocks. Because I thought you just put money in it. No, you have to put money in it and you have to buy the stocks. Um, so I know one that they both keep talking about every time is one is the VOO. Um, you can look that up, VOO. It's the ID, and I was like, oh, okay, so that's my goal. My goal is I want to start contributing. Once I mapped out all my bills of how much I can afford to like put aside and still like save and still put money to my savings and stuff, um, I want to put at least 500 a month into um, the Roth IRA account, so that's my goal. Um, I just have to wait and see when can I apply for that because I'm still learning about it. I don't know if it was like a deadline or not, but if you know a lot about Roth IRA, please let me know in the comments below. And like I said, I'm still contributing to my high yield savings account. So that's kind of where we're at right now, but um, I'm about to work on filling some stuff out. And I guess I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys in a bit when we go back upstairs to finish today out because I still have two more meetings and then we'll be done for the day. And hopefully I can get a gym session in, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy like this live update of where have I been? Customer assist manager, new car, going back to school, contributing to a Roth IRA, all those type things. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. All right, so I just wanted to come back. I think I'm gonna, I look a mess, y'all. I think I'm gonna end, end the vlog here. Um, I like took a nap and like I laid on the couch checking out because one of my meetings got canceled. So and it's raining today here in Charlotte, North Carolina. So I was not in the mood doing anything else, but I'm back up now sitting at my laptop about to um, sit at my laptop about to finish making some notes on follow up emails from our calls for today. Put those in Salesforce for tracking purposes, like what we talked about. Um, some big initiative we're just working on going forward. And then, yeah, that's gonna be that on that. But I just wanna come get you a little quick video. I'm gonna try to do weekly videos. I, I, I want to do like once a video every two videos a week, but with my life and I know everything that's going on, trying to be like work productive, still have a life being outside. That's gonna do for this video, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And let me know let me know in the comments below what you guys want to see as um, far as in future videos, as far as content. Um, but like I said, this is more like an update, what's been going on, what I'm working on, type of thing. Um, and yeah, definitely make sure you like, share, and subscribe. We are almost to 10,000 subscribers. We're like less than 500 subscribers away from 10,000. So like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.